Yeah, the coach report prepared me already on uh, Sunday, I think, for the game. He said, yeah, maybe we're going to play on, on Thursday because Jeff was suspended. So my focus was on Thursday. Um, during the week, he helped me really well to train on the left back position. And I think the team helped me as well. And then you see, you came into the game, they help you, you help yourself to play good, to play simple. And uh, it was a good performance. Your first. Sight I've seen those Rangers away, those Rangers fans that are travelling European trip. I mean, to celebrate with them at the end, what did that mean? Yeah, I think it's always to it's always good to connect with the supporters and uh, you see in the game they give us so much energy and you want to give this back. So I think uh, it's a good game from all sides and uh, now we have to focus on Sunday. When was the last time you played at left back? Can you remember the last time you had to play at left back? Uh, Yes, I played last last season. I got last to season. Okay, okay. play the left back, yeah. and the coach know it, so he put me there and I do what I can. So and where do you see yourself playing going forward? Where? Well, I don't know. It's up to the coach. I just had a good game today, but Jeff Day is uh, is available to play on Sunday as well. So we will see what happens. You would like to be involved on Sunday if you can. For the first time, Ibrox will be full to capacity for the new season. That'll be something you'd be looking forward to. Yeah, of course, of course. I think uh, when I made my debut in the Ibrox, it was really special because I was like waiting for it and the coach put me on. It was a really good feeling for me as well to see the people, see the great stadium and uh, good support. How have you been settling in? Obviously, there's a few Dutch people here. You know, the manager speaks Dutch as well. How has that been for you? So I just find your feet be able to, you know, adapt to life in Scotland. Yeah, it's good. I think the coach helped me as well because uh, when I don't understand something, then he explained me in Dutch for the for the players as well. We can communicate in Dutch, so it's easier for us I to understand each other. I hear the, the boys they've been calling you Nana because they can't say your name. Is that? Yeah, they, they can, they can. But it's it's a, it's a lot of, it's a lot more easier to say Nana. <laughs> if you say Nara show, it will be longer. And <laughs> you have to have short terms in football, so Nana is good. Nana, to you. Um, you could play in a lot of positions. Do you mind changing them out game to game? Or you, does that impact your performance? So you just totally focused on getting minutes at the moment. Yeah, I'm, I'm totally focused on getting minutes. I want to play as much as I can. I don't care where it is. Just where I can help the team and play. Was that a big part of, of the, and the appeal of coming to Rangers, trying to, regardless of where you play, kind of play consistently after after your loan spell last season? Yeah, of course. Of course, you're going to Rangers. I have a good chat with the, with the coach. And I want to play as much as I can. This is why I made a step to Rangers. Uh, playing next to Robin Proper, a player maybe you know from the, the Dutch league a little bit as well. How did you find that playing next to him for the first time tonight? Yeah, good is what I say. We can communicate in Dutch. And yeah, he's a good guy, good player. And for me to stand next to him is really good because he's really direct. And he's really directing what he wants, what he expects from me, what I expect from him. So we understand each other. How much you look forward to playing in the Europa League then? Because there's going to be some really big ties after tonight's win. Yeah, I don't know. I want to play as much as I can. Europa League competition, cup, don't matter. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.